Yeah. New OT ROM hack, the Sealed Palace. We'll go ahead and get started. Three, two, one, go. Sonic O Sonic O six. Oh my goodness. <laughs> hey. <laughs> I need that as a sound effect now. Uh oh. Alright, so we're a kid. We're in we're in prison from the looks of it. Something terrible has happened. We don't have much time left. And yeah, get up. Hey, come on. Okay, that's pretty much the same line from OOT. Link sleeps with his eyes open. Yeah, he's seen some shit. He finally woke up. I'm Navi the Fairy. Might not remember how you got here. The Kikiri have been captured by Ganondorf soldiers. Hello? That took a dark turn. Yo, Relayer, how's it going? Final Pido is in the prison. The kingdom is at peace. Okay. Alright, we got money. What, I can't get on that? I cannot get on that. Okay. Yo, that's fucked up. <laughs> They're all locked in here. What the hell? Go ahead and explore a little bit. I I heard the snoring, but I couldn't I couldn't see what was over there. Oh, hey, a switch. Well, I get to hang for a bit. Oh, the child. Yeah, we're all locked in here. What the hell? The dark start. Wouldn't that kill them? Oh, no. Uh, Lore-wise, yeah. If the Kikiri leaves the... The Kikiri Force or Lost Woods, they die. I hear a sleepy man. So do I. <clears throat> Alright, yeah, hold on. Any of these armors real? No. Don't seem to be the, the case. Can't use any of these. Finish your transmedia thing and analysis? Nice! Uh, did it get graded? Alright, this seems pretty straightforward. Nothing fancy with this room. Alright, we gotta move. Can't let that guard see us. Of course he won't see us. We just gotta be careful. Still waiting on that? Okay, gotcha. I'm sure you'll score well. It seemed like a pretty interesting project. Alright, soaring is getting louder. Okay, might have not been the best idea to break that. What do we got here? Our first chest of the ROM hack. It's a bloopy. Yo, Lin, how's it going? This is a uh, a new OOT ROM hack called the the Sealed Palace. <clears throat> oh, we found <laughs> we found Greg. That's it. We've won the seed, guys. It's it's over. Five minutes seed. GGs. Is there anything over here? Nope. Is it scary? I have no idea. I'm going into this blonde. But we, uh, so, for anybody who just showed up, basically Ganondorf captured all the Kikiris, 
<clears throat> and I started out in a gel cell. I like this so far. Uh, do I need all that money? Probably not. I don't have a way to kill them yet. Oh, okay. So I am going to have to go that way. Barpy. <laughs> no, there, there's no, there's nothing for Green Pea or Greg. That, that's interesting. Is there a trigger for collecting all these? I doubt it. Nope, definitely don't have any equipment. Ooh, look at this. <clears throat> it's a custom map. Hyrule Castle. Plot hole. Don't carry die if they leave the fortress? Or the forest? Yeah. Lore what? Uh, yeah. If you're going off the lore, they do. Thank you, Tree Scare, and they could carry the beast. I, I, I guess we'll get our answers. We'll get our answers somehow. Okay. So obviously, I have missed something so far. Because there is no way to hit this switch. All right, let's let's go back in. <clears throat> then to Kikiri and leave the forest at the end of the OOT. Yeah, they did. In the ending credits, you're absolutely correct. They did leave. Um, if I had to take a guess, maybe for some reason at the end of OOT, uh, the Kikiri were given the ability to uh, to exist outside of the forest. I guess it just all depends on what the will of the uh, current Deku Tree wants. Oh shit. Hold on. Does this take place after Ocarina at a time? I, as far as I can tell, it seems like it's an alternate history. So, uh... Uh, like I said, when it, whenever I woke up as Link, all Navi told us is that Ganondorf captured all the Kikiri and uh, imprisoned them within Hyrule Castle. So I'm guessing this is OOT, but if Ganon won. Okay, I... Oh. Yes, it... The uh, the title of the the ROM hack is in the uh, in the stream screen, the sealed palace. Can you repeat the setting? What's the context here? <laughs> is that a serious question, or are you just being sarcastic at this point? After O T, I. Okay, I, I should have made a command or something. Uh, read the tags. It's a blind playthrough. I have absolutely no idea what the story is. Just like you all. All I know is literally like the first eight minutes of this game. Never seen anything like this. There's been several... Uh, Rama hacks like this before. But nothing that goes over uh, a situation where Ganondorf captures all the Kikiri. Zoned out the exact second Len asked that same question. Well, shit. <laughs> well, I get the feeling I'm going to pr probably have to repeat myself a lot. So, uh, I don't know if you're still there, Kill. If you can make a Nightbot command that uh, just basically gives like a a quick uh, description of what happens at the beginning of this. You could put down something like Ganondorf captures all the Kikiri. Yo, Jazzy, how's it going? But yeah, long story short, uh, you wake up in prison, Ganondorf captured all the Kikiri, and you're in Hyrule Castle. 
man, I got caught. <laughs> yeah, if, if you don't mind, Kill. Because there's going to be a lot of people asking this question. Like, I literally woke up right here. And Navi woke me up the same way that she would do in OOT. Except she she mentioned that Ganondorf captured all the Kikiri. Missing a Link is the best ROM hack. I have yet to play that one, but I do want to play it soon. <clears throat> uh, you do not. You do not start Twilight Princess in the cell. You start Twilight Princess in your own home. Alright, we gotta hide from this boy. You'll probably just hide right here. Now, in your wolf form in Twilight Princess, you start in a cell. Alright, hopefully the guard doesn't see us here. Okay. Uh, can we talk to her? We can. You escaped? Be careful, Inya. We need to be quiet, or else the guards will catch you. Those soldiers burned down the whole village. Holy shit. Sorry I mentioned that she left her ocarina in one of the... Oh my goodness. <laughs> the guards don't stop whenever you're in the middle of talking. <laughs> that sucks. Was Run be in the YouTube channel? Uh, it depends. It honestly just depends. Hope you like this ROM hack. I loved it. Yo. Thank you, Runs. <laughs> What's ha- <laughs> I, That's an interesting uh, command. Will it be a VOD? I, like I said, it depends. I'm not going to give a yes or no answer to that. I want to see how this uh, plays out because it may be more than one stream. You have to do a random accent whisper shout for any colored words. Uh, maybe. Maybe. You, you may have to find a different streamer for that. Alright, I gotta skip what she's already said so far. Mention that she left her ocarina in the castle guard gardens. Okay. Is there anything over here? No. So I literally just need to go up here. Yo, Astro, how's it going? First time I actually caught you live. First watch from one of your YouTube vods. Oh, I take it it was one of the um, Ocarina of Time Majora's Mask combo randos. Yeah, this is a relatively new Ocarina of Time ROM hack. Okay, we were already in here, right? Alright, so I guess I can use this upper platform to avoid the guards. Yeah, that's what it looks like. How's the bunny seed setting? I haven't touched it in about a week. Um, so long story short, for those of you that uh, weren't keeping up in the Discord channel or anything, um, my brother actually was in the hospital for close to a week with a severe digestive infection. So, I needed to, um, to look after him and, uh, do visits, all that good stuff. But, uh, he's finally recovering back at home, uh, and I figured I'd ease back into streaming with, uh, with a rum hack. OT or MM guards, the only weakness, looking up. It seems to be that way, yeah. Alright, so I got a key. And it looks like you can jump on these hedges, although... The distance is going to be... Yeah, we're just not going to be able to reach. <clears throat> Alright, I see the guards. Uh, oh, the doorway over here. Yeah, yeah, it's my brother. Alright, uh, we don't want to get caught by the guard. So we're going to walk out over here. 
Oh, what's out this way? Oh, we don't want to go there. <laughs> we'll immediately get caught. Yeah, thank you. I appreciate it. Yeah, it was it was very touch and go for a bit. He got incredibly sick, um, but finally got him on some uh, antibiotics, some pain medicine, and uh, he's he's finally back to eating solid foods. As a matter of fact, he uh, he had a nice uh, nice sleep after eating some uh, country front steak today. Uh oh, red rupee. Now, if only we could knock out the guards. Alright, what? This probably takes me back out to the garden? Okay. Is there anything over here? Doesn't look... Look that way. All right, let's head upstairs and try not to get uh, caught by the guards. All right, I see one boy over there. We got a barred door. Guard vision is kind of janky, so I don't think he's gonna see us. Uh oh, big chest. Is this the ocarina? Oh no, it's the Kikiri sword. They stole the Kikiri sword, too. The guards seen this treasure of the Kikiri, but you got it back now. Interesting. Okay. Is this even rando? <laughs> Good question. Okay, so he does a complete circle. I wonder if it's worth it to go all the way upstairs. Yo, Jason, thank you for the welcome. I appreciate it. Astral watching three consecutive streams? Oh my. Okay, here we go. This isn't on a timer, is it? Doesn't seem to be. Alright, where's our guard buddy at? Okay, you can absolutely backflip over the fence. I wasn't expecting that. Uh, hello? He's got eyes in his ass. He shouldn't have seen me. He didn't take the sword from me, though. Go now, double seven bunker bombs. Sounds like your brother had it worse than me, too. I mean, he, he had it pretty bad. He said it was the worst pain in his life. And he suffered through an appendicitis... Uh, a shattered ankle, um, a broken sternum, and he still said this this was the most painful thing he's ever dealt with. No, I... Yeah, it, it, it was very ouch. Alright, is this guard gonna see me here, or... I know I can just side hop back, uh, past him with like, yeah, he does see me there. So their their vision range is just as janky as it is in OOT. <clears throat> Preonitis. It's also sick all the same time. Well, I hope you're feeling better. Did the doctors mention what kind of bacterium was causing it? Uh, not yet. Uh, they took some tissue samples, but they're not entirely sure what may have caused it. It could be bacterial, or it could be complications due to, um, Crohn's disease or ulcerative colitis. Link did indeed get sent the gel. Uh, Ganondorf captured all of the Kikiri, and apparently Link was asleep for the whole thing. He woke up in gel.
What a way to wake up. That's all I'm gonna say. Alright, that's a bombable wall. Alright. Should be back in the garden? Shit, if only I could knock out the guards. That's what happens whenever Navi doesn't wake you up. If she was just incredibly late to waking me up. That's exactly what happened. No, hey, listen, only sleep. Link isn't Kikari, he shouldn't have been captured. I mean, he was in the same village and he's wearing a green tunic. They probably considered him Kikiri too, for all I could tell. Where is that guard at? It's hard to tell from the uh, the hedges sometimes. But it looks like the guard runs around in a circle. Oh, you know what I need to do? I need to go kill this Deku Baba. For no... Alright, guard, don't see me. Ganondorf would probably kidnap Link regardless. I'm surprised he didn't kill them. To be... <laughs> to be perfectly honest with you. Although Ganon... Ganondorf might still be hiding his identity as, uh... As, like, an usurper to the throne. He put the Kikiri sword in a stupid sp Yeah, kind of. You're not wrong about that. I guess what they should've- should've, uh, done is make sure that there weren't any holes in the gel cells. Okay, I should be able to get up this way. Alright, don't see me this time. That would be terrible. Wait. So it's the same item menu layout as OOT. There, there's not going to be a tracker for this. It's a it's a vanilla playthrough. Why do I need a tracker? Worst pain I've ever been in is having a properly lubricated catheter administered at the hospital. Yikes. That's an ouch. Oh, it's Ihu. Again, he probably made a good case. They should be captured, but not enough to prove they're dangerous enough for murder. Alright, what's down here? Okay. <laughs> Someone remembers that old, uh, that old sound effect. Come on. There we go. When in doubt, kill all the enemies. That's not my friend, that's my brother. Alright. What do we got here? Another small key. I think Catherine put in wobs in surgery one time, however, did not enjoy the removal. No, Catherine removals are quite painful. They're not fun. Actually, this may be covering something. Yeah, it was pretty rough. I imagine I have to light all these torches. Alright, so we got a key there. But we're not finished with this room. We're probably going to need a slingshot for that. Wow, this is a pretty big uh, first area. Uh oh Okay. So we're not going any further than this. Okay. I know where I'm at. Countless molten hot needles stabbing in all the wrong places. Ooh. 
And now we have stick. Okay. All right, so we finally opened that gate. Ow. Where's the stone mask? Good question. Where is the stone mask whenever I need it? All right, there's probably another guard in the maze itself. So I kind of want to be careful. Okay. That's okay. I, I, I wanted more nuts anyways. Eat the stick. Yeah. Eat the stick. Feign, feign a choking hazard. So that the guards uh, come to your rescue instead. Uh oh. Maybe this is the ocarina. No. <laughs> Why? Music's a bit repetitive. I mean, it's a ROM hack. I, I wouldn't expect a AAA title out of this. Alright. I gotta go with old school ocarina item placement. Surely he won't see me back here. As a matter of fact, I'm gonna wait for him to move. Okay. Okay, so we're past the guards. The door seems to be jammed. Okay. Here's our first key. Uh, does this take us back to the room? Oh, okay. So this takes us back to this room here. And we already have two small keys, so... We'll say one thing, the game doesn't say anything about, but D-pad down works for Ocarina. Wait, seriously? <laughs> what the hell? Interesting. I guess, uh, I guess the user interface just didn't get put in for it. Alright, before I hit that switch... Let's see what's up here. Okay. <laughs> we now know what the switch activates. And there's no reason for me to attack. Well... You know what? I got plenty of nuts now. Wait, was that it? It was just the one boy. Okay. <laughs> I, d I just got unlucky. Do you feel naked without a timer? A little bit, maybe. I just feel like a timer would be a good way to track how long I've been playing this. What kind of jam is the door jammed with? Strawberry jam, maybe. Grape? Ooh. Alright, chat. Here, here's the first question for debate night. Grape or strawberry jam? Oh, hey, it's Princess Zelda. Uh, Link, why did you draw your sword? You, I've seen you. You are the one from my dreams. Listen to what I have to say. Don't slip my throat. Strawberry hands down. Yo, Nikki. Grape, no doubter. <laughs> we don't have much time. Sorry I mentioned that you would be coming. Where's sorry at? In my dreams, I saw dark clouds, evil pouring across the lands, and forest burning. They burned Kikiri Forest. Blackberry, ooh. Okay. Raspberry? Believe that the two court advisors are the source of this ominous feeling. 
Even my father has been caught in their evil schemes, but I think we can do something. Take a look at this story passed down by the royal family. <clears throat> Pretty good use of the uh, the actor animated uh, animations. Great, be like open wide, kids. Yo, that's an interesting background. The evil will continue to spread throughout Hyrule unless we seal it within the sacred realm. Has that white border been here the whole time, by the way? Let me see if I can fence that. Uh, I guess it has been. Huh. Okay, there we go. I think so. Alright, should be fits now. Fed apricot and chili jam? Ooh, chili jam sounds interesting. Evil will continue to spread throughout Hyrule unless we seal it within a sacred realm. The sit sages will assist you in stopping Ganon. In order to awaken all the other sages, you must become even more powerful. You must travel over mountains, underwater, and even through time. I will teach you the song passed down by the sages. The song to return you to the Temple of Time, the Overture of Lights. Ooh, unique song? Okay. Forgot about Cactus Jam? Ooh. Hey, I didn't mess up that song. How about that? Is this the storybook, or are we somewhere else now? Good question. I have no idea. <laughs> I don't believe you. <laughs> I mean, we could be in a sacred realm, we could be in an LSD trip, who knows. As long as you hold the Master Sword. Which I don't have yet. You hope time yourself in your hands. I hope we meet again. Alright. That's cool. Apparently this story ends with a nut. Oh my goodness. Link is in Zelda's bed. What the hell happened? <clears throat> How long would it take to... Wait... <laughs> Which jam is jamming the door? I didn't even know you made a pull. <laughs> you collapsed after reading that book. Princess Zelda already left. Do you know a way we can get out of here? <sighs> Beats me. Maybe break through the window? Just jump? I like the, the camera pan. That's nice. Yeah, we fell asleep again. Yeah. Oh, hey, hold on here. Yeah, we're just gonna trample over the royal family book. No big deal. Nice. Let's try it again. It's time from a little bit better angle. Okay, that time Link just didn't even bother uh, grabbing the platform. Okay. Very nice. Great, fantastic start. Okay. Let's try grabbing it from this side. There we go. Give me my good news and bad news. Uh, the good news is that's now a, uh, a uh, not a sound effect. <laughs> the good news is, is that's now a uh, points redeem. The bad news is I'm probably going to forget it every single time someone redeems it. Also, holy shit. Why is there so many point redeems? I've literally only been back for 43 minutes. Gives Link a bottle of 85% Smirnoff vodka. Bro <laughs> Hold off on those points, kill. Uh, I'll do that stuff later.
known platformer, Zelda. Oh my goodness. Y'all are gonna make me turn off the point redeems. <clears throat> Alright, I guess I'm going back down here. Also, why would Zelda's room be up this ladder? Guarded by a switch, guarded by Armos. What the hell? What is Rita Dongo? Uh, different voice, basically. But we'll get into that later. I feel like I need more drinks now. Marmalade? Marmalade jam. Interesting choice, chat. Okay, let's see here. Guess I could, well, just like no reason whatsoever to jump over there. Alright. The guards are still here. So if I were to run out, I would immediately be caught. Lemon jam. Is there even such a thing? I feel like one of these boxes could very easily be, uh... Could be blocking a, like a crawl space or something. Oh my goodness. Alright. I'm just gonna end up, like, turning off all the points. <laughs> Is there anything down here? Do you want Link drunk or not? I have honestly no clue if there's alcohol on this ROM hack. Probably not. Unless this is Master of Time. Then it very well could be alcohol. Clearly, sorry, it's not- I- I- I'm glad you're proud. You can- you can take it to the grave with me. And tell it to your grandchildren. I need more nuts. Alright, have I been through the store yet? I think so. At least I have a way out now. If I can find a way out. I haven't seen a way out yet. So I go back the way I came. Rap for us? <laughs> that would be interesting to, to see uh, kill rap. Yo, Icky, how's it going? Yo, do me a favor, uh, use the bloopy command. I think you'll like it. Okay. You can't freestyle, I need Tom. Kill going for the epic rap battles of history. Okay, it didn't work. Alright, so we don't want to go that way. Guess we're going back through here. I, again, I have no idea. I have not seen Mido at all. He, he may be the one behind this. Alright. Well, that's easy enough. Oh, shit. <laughs> the, the door disappeared on me. What the fuck? Glad he who is doing better now. I appreciate it. But it was probably on Gandorf's side. Most likely, yeah. Alright. Our boy is probably walking back. Nope, he is. Oh yeah, he's definitely walking back. So I'm gonna get caught. Does the door just stay open though? That's the question. Yo. <laughs> imagine, imagine throwing me back into the cell, but not locking the door. Oh wait, hold on. 
I know exactly where I need to go. I have Deku sticks. I need to go back to that room with the um, with all those torches, which is back up here somewhere. You without the beard just throw me off. I may need I may need to grow it back out a bit. Bio doesn't strike me as evil. He strikes me as pompous. I mean, yeah, it could be a case, yeah. Uh, was this? Okay. It was just a statue. He already has importance in the village. I don't think he'd be easily bought that way. Uh, hello. That is, uh, quite a range of vision you got there, good sir. Forgot how funny Monster Hunter Rise is with friends. It's pretty fun. I need, to, I need to start playing it more now that, uh, well, I would say now that the uh, title update is going to happen soon, but it's still like a month out, I think. Yes. The answer to that is yes. Refund yourself and everyone else if you don't mind. I should, I should have turned off the point redeems, but, uh. I wasn't thinking about it before I started streaming. Title update 5 needs to come out already. Right? That'd be nice. Okay, that clearly didn't matter. Uh, it's one of these other entrances, isn't it? Over here, I bet. <clears throat> I think it was that room? Where's that guard at, though? Okay, he's walking over that way. So, I should be able to beat him to this door. There we go. Oh, hold on. Is there a way to get to a torch? That's not gonna be it. There's no torch down here. I'm gonna test something out real quick. Can I backflip over this? I can, absolutely. Liking it so far? I'm honestly not even out of the first area yet. I hear, I hear a torch, but it's nowhere near me. Oh wait, never mind. There are no torches here at all. So maybe I need Den's fire. Maybe that's what uh, it wants me to do. Alright, where's uh... Where's our boy at? He's over there. So I gotta wait for him to run around. <clears throat> See that door takes me back to the garden, I believe. Nice. I doubt you get dens and magic here. Probably not. Let's see if there is anything up here. Looks like just rubies. I'll take that though. It doesn't look like there's any other Etsin that I could walk out of here. It may be the other way from my gel cell, so I'm just gonna go ahead and let myself get caught real quick. Although, I mean, yeah. That would be a huge plot twist. Just get dins within the first hour of uh, playing this ROM hack. 
I guess I'll just retrace my steps and see if there's anything else I can use my sword on. <clears throat> there was a room with a lit torch and two unlit ones. I didn't even notice that, that room. But I'll see if I can find it again. Uh, there wasn't anything important in here, right? No, nah, just that bloopy. <laughs> yeah, it's another raw rupee. Huh. Hi, curiosity. Nah, that didn't work. Alright, back out here. Oh, this side was the dead end. Yeah, you don't see me. Yeah, this, uh, this uh, uh, guard didn't have eyes in the back of his head. No problem. Alright. Oh hey, there's our uh, there's our jam again. <clears throat> All right, let's uh let's go back through here and see if there's anything else we can do in this room. Just candles from what I can see. But really, who puts <laughs> who puts Zelda's room up here? What the hell? Princess Zelda's room. Alright, nothing to read. Can't push any of these. Or that. Yeah, nothing here. Let's see if we can find that room that had the, uh, the torch that could be lit. Because now that you mention it, I do remember seeing a room like that, but I cannot remember for the life of me where it is. Doubt it's here. That side is the. Let's see. I get familiar with this area. Yo, Twitch plays. How's it going? Uh, this is a relatively new ROM hack called um, the Sealed Palace. All right. So I am not going that way. Is there anything on the side of this? I don't think so. Okay. Yo, thank you for the 30 bits. I appreciate it. <clears throat> Alright. So instead... Let's figure out what else we can do here. See, I keep thinking that there's torches in this room. I don't think there are. Unless there's something hidden in between the bookcases, maybe? No. Doesn't look like it. Playing that Zelda. Absolutely. Oh, there's just a staircase right here next to the door. Hmm. 
Alright. Is there anything back here? No. <laughs> Trying to be discreet. Oh, a pot! Let's smash it. Totally not gonna get caught by doing that. He's totally not going to see me here, right? I can see his feet. He can't see me. Alright. Oh, here we go. Here's the room. Oh, you know what? I don't even need to do that. Really? Uh, hold on. Ah! <laughs> Almost had it. There we go. Probably not the intended way to do that, but... Backflip? Probably could have backflipped, yeah. Alright, so we got another small key. I haven't seen another locked door, though. <laughs> Thank goodness this place only hires deaf guards. Alright, so we got that out of the way. Oh, actually, yeah. That's probably, now that you mention it, that's probably the intended way to get around this arm house. You just backflip over him. <laughs> Alright. See, the thing is, is, I don't remember seeing another doorway that needed a key. At least to my knowledge. Unless I just walk walk past it and I'm blonde. Which is quite the possibility. Now nah, I have no idea. We'll figure it out eventually. Uh I have an idea. <laughs> I have an idea. I don't know if it's gonna work or not, but we're gonna try it. Ah shit! I figured if I could uh if I could side hop fast enough to where my feet barely touch the ground, they wouldn't notice me. But fun fact, they noticed me. Alright, so... I wonder if there's anything over on this side of the gel cells. They're deaf, not stupid. Fun fact, though, uh, in the vanilla game, Whenever you're going to see uh, Zelda, if you do perfect side hops and you barely touch the ground at all, the guards will not notice you. They're also a little blind. These are very poor guards. Alright. There's gotta be something when he sells. Where is that noise coming from, though? Alright, let's just go through here. I killed this Skulltula real quick. Alright, we got one Skulltula. Now, why is there a web here? I guess it doesn't really matter, huh? The guard is having a solid net. Is it the guard that's snapping? Hold on. What the fuck? It is... 
The guard is just sleeping. What the hell? Gandorf is emotionally fragile and needs psych <laughs> psychologist trained guards. Yeah, it's the guard at the table that's sleeping. What the hell? Did not, uh, did not expect that. Alright. But there's nothing over here. I didn't see any other doors to unlock. Unless this key is used to unlock that jam door. Oh, there's suddenly a bloopy over here now. What the hell? Game trying to bait me. It's totally trying to bait me. <laughs> yeah, he really cleaned up his act. Lost a lot of weight, decided to get a guard position. Working for Ganondorf now. You know, the usual stuff. Was there a locked door over here? Nah, just a Deku Baba. Oh, where's the guard at? Oh, there's the guard. Okay, that was just a switch. Well, that's something that opens when you slay all the enemies in the area. That's what I was thinking, but... I don't, um... I, I guess I could try to kill all the enemies in this area? I don't know what would happen if I jumped down onto the maze. Let's see here. Doesn't look like there's any doors there. Yeah, that door's definitely still jammed. Does the hedge say something from the right angle? Oh, like, does it spell out anything? S, U, S, E, F, <laughs> Susuf? I don't know. <laughs> That's all I could figure out there. <laughs> Did you try hitting the jam door? How about nutting it? Oh! You know what it is, chat? I'm a dumbass. We're all dumbasses. You know why? There's no way out of here. You play the Overture of Light. I was sitting here thinking... Hey, there's got to be a, a doorway out of here, right? No. I, I, ju I just thought of it. It's the warp song. Boy, am I an idiot. If you said it, I didn't see it. Or it didn't pop up. This must be the door that seals the sacred room. Wow, the uh, Temple of Time looks like it's seen better days. Yeah, what the fuck happened here? <laughs> Fart must have destroyed this place. There appears to be three markings in the inscription on the plaque. Okay. I mean... Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh, hello? The Haunted Wasteland is here? Uh, let's go back inside. <laughs> it's more busted in Breath of the Wild? Yeah, just a little bit. Prince of Persia, the Temple of Tom. Alright, see if this still reads the same. Three hollow, oh, yeah, that's right. Pressing B just skips all the text. Three spiritual stones. 
Okay. Same thing as normal. Do we have the ability to do door time skip? It doesn't look like it. It looks like we're sealed shut. Prince of Persia, the Temple of Time. Uh, it looks like we have multiple ways to get out there. My goodness, what happened to this place? Oh. You know what? Doesn't look like I'm going this way. Not as an adult, or not as a child at least. Unless. Unless. Hold on, I got an idea. Ah, shit. I bet we can make this happen. We can totally make this happen. <laughs> Pretty sure you're not supposed to get up here until you're an adult. So let's see what's back here. Uh, levers? <laughs> Hello? Alright. I've seen enough. It's levers. Not the odd poultice, eye drops, and butcher saw. I mean, who knows? It could be those things. Ah. Fart trumpets and levers. <laughs> Your punishment is evil green Goombas? No. I can't handle that. Okay, apparently Ganondorf decided to uh, bring the desert to Hyrule. Because this definitely looks like the outside to the Temple of Time. Holy shit. We will have to find a way through that desert? You're telling me. Holy shit. Yep, this is definitely Hyrule Market. What the hell happened? Yo, Ganondorf went into fucking god mode or something. That's what happened. This place is destroyed. Oh shit. Okay, so time passes here too. Makes sense since he ends a Gerudo. Hey, here's the nice thing. I won't have to play Bomchi Bowling now. Can you secret technique climate change? Yeah, that's what he did. He melted all the ice caps in Hyrule. He's like, you see that ice cavern? Nah, it's not a thing anymore. Hello? Okay. Happy one hour, by the way. Thank you. Alright, I guess that's a way to get back up there. Alright, so if the market looks like this, what does Hyrule Castle look like? Rich melted all the ice traps for April Fool's Day, and now this is the consequences? Yeah, we can blame Love Rush for this. She started climate change in Hyrule. Also, is there not a way up there? I guess not. Or at least not a way up there yet. Also, if you can't see anything in this, don't worry, you're not alone. I can't see it either. Alright, I'm guessing this is the area around the guard shack that is not here anymore.
This would be the moat, right? I think. Oh my goodness. Yeah, this definitely has to be like Hyrule Films that I'm in now. Alright, well, chat, it's time to follow the flags. Alright, where else are we going now? Oh, hold on. Oh, uh, of course. Oh, never mind. Never mind. I thought we voided out again. Why well, take out the Gorilla Valley music and replace it with anti music? Good question. Why is Castle Town here all of a sudden? I have questions. <laughs> The townsfolk here must not know that the Kikiri are being imprisoned. Maybe we can ask around. That's a good, good idea. Let's ask around. You gonna take us back to jail? Make sure you visit the church graveyard to honor those soldiers that gave us this piece. Well, looks like we're going to the graveyard, kiddos. Where are we at on the map? Okay, so we were in Hyrule Castle. Now we're in Castle Town. And this was the Haunted Wasteland. So I'm guessing the Temple of Time was somewhere in the Haunted Wasteland. Gerudo Ascent, Gerudo City, Sacred Realm, the Mountain, Mountain Peak, Lost Woods, East Coast, Lawlon Ranch, and the Ocean. I heard an interesting theory about Link and his connection to M.M. and Twilight Princess. Are you talking about, like, Ocarina of Time Link? Ah, oh, yes. The church. The church. Ah, oh, yes. The graveyard. Alright. Oh, boy. A warehouse. I see silver rubies. So what's the first thing I do whenever I go into Castle Town? Uh, I I climb into a giant oven. That's what I do. Ah ah! Get me out of here! <laughs> that was not a smart idea. Okay, note the self. We don't go in there until we have a few more hearts. Cool. No hearts, huh? No hearts at all. I like all the rubies. I like how stinking filthy and rich I am. Oh, cool. You can actually land on this. Very interesting. So Lincoln MM never managed to make it back to Kikiri Village because he was a cute human, didn't have Navi. Link grew up lost in the forest and his grudge made him that skeleton warrior. That's, that's one way to look at it, yeah. It's possible. Cool. Ah, yes. The beeping is now gone.
All right, we gotta bonk the trees. See if there's any skulls here. No. Yo, salty med pack. How's it going? Game theory about this ROM hack. Link was in prison for vandalism and property damage. The weeping is the soundtrack of your life. What, am I in a museum or something now? I guess so. Man, look at those crystals. Uh-oh. I see the skull mask, the spooky mask, Majora's mask. I see a great fairy sword. See a Sheikah covering. Temple of Time. Master Sword Pedestal. Hello. Are these cameos? Wait, is this... This it? This it for this building? Nice. I guess so. Man. Watch me trample on all this stuff. Alright. Yep, this is a relatively new ROM hack. <laughs> Majora's Mask should not be that easy to steal. You would think, right? Oh. We're just gonna barge into everyone's house. Anything back here? No. Alright, we're gonna climb up before we go down. Ground pound. If only. Instead we get row pound. Oh, that was bull. Bet you could totally make that jump over there. Oh, hey, how's it going? <laughs> totally didn't just barge into your house or anything. Whoa! Hello there. The king has made a huge effort to keep us safe after that war. Make yourself at home. I will be tending my flowers. Yeah, you go ahead and tend those flowers. Nice. There's no, like, doorway here? My goodness. Everyone just likes to have their bedrooms either up or down a large flight of ladders. <coughs> Ooh. <coughs> I think I'm allergic to Castletown, guys. All right. What's in this house? Uh-oh. Is this money that I can't hold? Nope, it's a recovery heart. Oh, uh, what do we got here? I kind of, I like some of the new textures so far. They look pretty cool. Blessing. Yo, Markars, how's it going? Allergic to the BS that is going on here. <laughs> yeah, it's good cardio getting in and out of bed by using a ladder. Speaking of cardio, look at this woman go. What a workout. Have you seen the mask collection in the museum? I heard that up in the mountains, there lives an artist that made those eerie masks. They say that he lives alone and has been alive for more than 100 years. Creepy, right? Kinda sounds like a Rita to me. Kinda fucked up. <laughs> oh, we got some more lore at least. Oh, hey man. How's it going? Ahem! Girls taking calisthenics to a whole new level. 
Yo, thank you for the, uh, good luck and have fun, kill. Have fun at work. No explanation as to why she's dancing. Beer is your pride and joy. Take that guy's beer down, chat. Does it not look luxuriant? I don't think I went in here yet. Stop. I hear a skull. What? I hear a doggo in here too, what the hell? Okay. Okay, so apparently you're one that for some reason does not like getting hit. Doggo. Oh, is he following me? He is absolutely following me. What was down here? Was it just the dog and his three skull buddies? No battle music? I, it, it's a ROM hack. Don't think too much into it. Okay. So we got the doggy and three skulls house. Oh, hello. Okay, the dog is now following me. I just gotta take him back to his owner, I suppose. All my husband does is sit upstairs eating beans. <laughs> he says that he'll make some money soon, but we'll see about that. Man, look at that face. The Temple of Time? Sorry, I've never heard of that place. I'm more worried about what's going on in the forest. What the fuck? Won't the guards do anything about those monsters? Okay. Yo, Bean Boy. Yeah, there's almost two pixels into that in that face. Yo, my man. How about some magic beans? Uh, hello. Okay, I guess I have to be on the bed. Alright. We got two beans, we're at 69 rubies. Very nice. Alright, doggy, let's go. Maybe you'll find your owner. If you even have an owner. Maybe I just have a dog with me for the rest of the game. Bean bed! Has anybody seen this lady? Well, I lost the dog. I haven't. I have found the house of Skultula, though. Oh, I got an idea. Okay. <laughs> when in doubt, walk towards the camera. You'll find a small key. Yeah. <laughs> These are like Resident Evil camera angles. Don't see it too often in OOC. Oh, hello! Okay. Okay. Oh my goodness, what is the- <laughs> What is the- 
Why does the hand grab so fast? What the fuck? Deku Tree music with some extra notes? Yeah, I got stun locked in that. What the hell? Alright, let's redo that room. And not... Not get caught by the hand? Oh, there was a key in here. You hear Redeads? Oh, maybe in that main room. It won't- oh, oh, it's one of these doors. One of these doors that, like, just barely creaks open. Yeah, you can see it there. And then as soon as I get close to it, it shuts. I did get knocked the fuck out. I was not expecting that. That was a crafty little trap. Oh yeah, <laughs> there's the other door. Oh, hello. Oh, it doesn't let me drop down. Bet I can do a little bit of parkour, though. E. Place is scary. Yeah. Tell me about it. I've already died in here. Wait, really? Okay. Guess there's no reason for me to climb up here, huh? Nut! Cool. I've used the key so far for a nut. I fell asleep at the base of the waterfall. I looked down and found webs wrapped around my feet. Then I woke up. Boy, that's cryptic. Alright, so one key was used for some... A red rupee and some nuts. Yeah, surprisingly few Skulltulas in the House of Skulls. Oh, hold on. What's this? Okay, if I can get on that rafter... Okay. We're on to something, chat. Uh-oh. <laughs> what have I done? That's where all the Skulltulas were. If every spider the curse in the entire world were destroyed, the curse would be broken. When you destroy a spider of the curse... Uh, okay, it says the same thing in the OOT. Okay, you'll make us very rich. Alright, they don't... Doesn't sound like they say anything in particular. Okay. 
Okay, this looks like it takes me back outside. Alright, what about here? Okay. What was in that other room, then? I guess it was just the hint about standing at the waterfall and then looking down. Oh, what happened to my dog? The dog's gone. No rando, so no hints. Hey, I found a potion shot. Uh, hello? Yo, guy. I'm going to assert my dominance by buying something while standing on top of your counter. I hope you don't mind. Is there anything else in here? Interesting. Oh... That's why you jump on the counter. I got you. Okay. No rolling for me. You peer into the crystal ball. A dark force is looming just be behind you. The vision starts to faint. What the f- <laughs> Well. That's raw. Interesting. Apparently the sack is the dark figure. Oh man, look at this picture. Anything up here? It's weird, like, some rooms you can... Or some buildings you can hold see up in, and other rooms you can't. Ooh, excuse me. Alright. Ah, uh, we don't need that money. Oh, there, there's no settings for this kid. This is a, um, this is a ROM hack. A ROM hack of Ocarina of Time that came out, I think, like, last week. Uh, it's going pretty well. Uh, he, James is back at the house. He's recovering quite well. Imagine this with the 3DS textures. I mean, at some point, we'll probably end up getting, like, Ocarina of Time 3D ROM hacks. Hope that one day I can work at the Hyrule Castle and serve Princess Zelda. They won't let me go up there to even visit anymore. I tried to get the king's permission, but those two advisors wouldn't let me see him. It's like they've got the whole castle on lockdown. Interesting. So no one in the castle town even knows what's happening in the castle. Oh, I found Greg again. Alright, surely there's gotta be like a bunch of pots in the, the guardhouse, right? That's how these work. So far, just a bunch of ladders. Oh, I see a big chest over there. We're sitting behind the blocks. Alright, let's see. Huh, that didn't reach, huh? So many doors, yeah. That, that's been the one thing about this ROM hack. It's, it's had a bunch of doors so far. You mean five ports gonna be lit? <laughs> Maybe it doesn't have a uh, spot to grab.
Unless... Hold on, I got an idea. It's maybe one of those where it, like, clips me up. Oh, no, it didn't. <laughs> I'm gonna give it one more try and see if I can do a jump slash at the top of the jump and uh, get up there. It may just be like a very peculiar timing. There we go. What do we got here? Oh, okay. I have the Hylian shield, but I don't have a Deku shield. So, chat, you get to see me turtle. Just got raw on this stray electron from space to hit your computer just right to send you up there. <laughs> right? Or jump slash. I wonder if that was the intended way to get up there. Probably, mo most likely. Castle Town. Oh shit, that's right. <laughs> you can't shield flick while backwalking like that. Oh my goodness, there's so many doors. How many ghost sculptors is that? Like four or five now? Four. Can't believe that is the explanation of that crazy Super Mario teleport up clip. Oh, which game? Imagine neutrino strats. Okay, that's the way I came from. Man, this town is a lot bigger than I thought it would be. This door seems to be jammed. Well then. Okay. Let me see if I can find the club. Alright, so I imagine I can probably run across the roofs. I absolutely can. Alright, so far so good. Got our parkour going on. Surely this dude gets me a heart piece. Yeah, don't fall off, Link. Good to see you again. I got a heart piece. Wait, can I even make that? The answer to that question is no, but can I make this? Oh, Super Mario 64? TTC Upwork Blitch? Should have time to do a multi-world in about a week? Oh, okay. The Night Owl. Try coming back here at night. Ooh. Sounds like a bar. <clears throat> oh. I hear a dog. Oh my goodness. These places are so big. Oh. That is not my dog. How could you mix up my puppy with a mutt like that? Why do you have this mutt in your house, then? Hello? Alright, so we found the dog lady, at least. Oh, man, that's a weird camera. Alright. 
So I just need to find that house that had uh, had the other dog. We should be good to go. Three guesses which one is her dog. Oh god, don't tell me that there's multiple dogs here. That's gonna get <laughs> gonna be annoying. This ROM is freaking you out. Oh wait, this is the house with the Yeah, you wanna see something to freak you out. Here you go. She just tending to her flowers. Alright. Now I gotta retrace my steps and find that uh that house with the uh the dog and the three skulls. So it looks like Oh, can I not go up that way? I guess not. It was one of these houses, I think. On uni break from the 7th to 16th. Oh, okay. Yeah, we'll see if we can get something set up. You know what? I don't even have time for you. Not even gonna deal with it. Come on, buddy. Sorry I had to had to kill your spooter friends, but I had to take you with me. Come on. The guy was doing a Super Mario 64 race with friends and ended up skipping a section of TikTok clock by doing a random up warp. What the hell? That that sounds insane. Uh, let's see. I think this was the doorway to her basement. Yeah, here we go. Yo, I brought your pupper friend back. It's Richard. Oh yeah, piece of heart out of it. Nice. For a decade, no one can replicate it. No one knew how you did it. General consensus is that a random space particle hit his console at just the right time. In just the right place. <laughs> and then she killed and ate Richard. I mean, honestly, would not doubt it right now. Now, this castle town is huge, by the way. Holy shit. Well, speaking of killing and eating things, here's a third dog. He found his way to the meat room. Okay. I'm not so sure I wouldn't steal from them. Okay. You know what? Seeing some of the stuff we've seen in this ROM hack so far, I... I'll take your word for it. <laughs> I will take I will I will take your word and you know what? Yeah, we'll we'll just uh we'll hold off on that. It could be one of those thief situations that you get from Link's Awakening. Oh, I was already in this guard house. That's right. Is there nothing else here? Okay, I'm sorry in the potion shop. Navi being genuinely helpful? It seems to be that way, yeah. Oh, okay. It just... Hold on. Okay. The building's designed two different ways, yet it's all the same potion shop. This house seems boarded up.
Oh, wait. There's the graveyard. Oh, no rush. Well, I found the church. The church sounds awfully spooky. Any reason why the church... Hello? Why does the church have to be spooky? Okay. Hey, buddy, can you explain why the church is so spooky? Hello there, son. I'm researching this process of making medicine by mixing holy water with various unusual compounds. Perhaps you've met that old lady living on the edge of a cliff. She's like a student of mine. Well, okay then. I'm getting some Resident Evil 4 vibes with this church. Okay. Oh boy, am I glad I don't have a Deku Shield. Alright, big chest. What do we have in here? A bottle! I wonder what this meant. By going to the church graveyard to paying to pay respects. Let's see. Do I still get to play the ocarina? Yes. Cool. So down on the D-pad does that regardless. So far, I gotta say this is a pretty interesting ROM hack. <laughs> Not sure what I think about the church yet, but. <laughs> I mean, I'm guessing this drops down at some point. Probably. Check the thingy. Check what thingy? That was a very vague description. The lectern? I have no idea what you're talking about. Thought I saw something up there. Maybe similar to the church and a link between worlds? Could be, yeah. Looks like there's two switches. Maybe there's something between the pews. Oh, the podium net sig, huh? I mean, I was already over there. Oh, you can actually check it. Even without the events of 40 years ago, I think man would still be a creature that fears the dark. Huh? There was an event 40 years ago. Okay. Forty spelt wrong. Again, it's a ROM hack. I don't expect perfection out of this. Uh, was I already in here? I'm pretty sure I was. Yes, I was. Alright, this ball's gotta come in, uh, come in handy for something, right? Uh oh. Can you see that? The warp pad? If you can hear me. An evil shadow looms across the lands. The force that we fought to seal so long ago is now moving again. You need to find the sources of power sealing him before they do. I will teach you the song to return here. Okay, cool. I get another warp song. 
The Dirge of Shadow. Okay, that's pretty interesting. So, I have a warp song back to uh, Castletown now. Or the graveyard, at least. <clears throat> you have learned a dirge of shadow. I will watch over the city. I'm counting on you. Why, thank you, statue. What's in here? It's like a mausoleum of sorts. What's behind it? Nothing. <clears throat> okay. Looks like that opens up at some point. I wonder what happens if we come here at night. <laughs> Dirty dirges done dirt cheap. Ah, yes. Some ACDC to, uh, to liven, liven up the ROM hack. <clears throat> Though kids can't go in the heart-pounding grave-digging tour at night. Since I can't do that, I'm just imitating Dampy the Gravekeeper all day. But with my cute face, I'm not heart-pounding at all. No, you're not. Uh-oh. <laughs> I wish that kid would stop imitating me. He does remind me of when I was a kid, though. Yo, where's Dampy at? <laughs> would you like to read Dampy's diary? Yes. I wish that kid would fuck off. Okay. I guess I have to warp up there. Let's try it real quick. Let's see where this actually takes me in here. Yep. So this is our way up to the warp pound. And a doorway. And I don't think we're getting up there. Not without some shenanigans. Okay, is that Zelda's Lullaby or Song of Time that we have to play there? Feels like a completely different guardhouse than where I was at. It's because it is. And now I'm up here. Alright. Strange. This door doesn't open. Oh, okay. It's gotta be up here for a reason, right? I jump over to this this roof. Hmm. Don't think I make that. Oh, I've already been down that way, anyways. Yeah, see, the only other thing would be to go up here. So, my guess now is that I have to come back here at night time. Hmm. 
Oh, there we go. Now we can check it. The crest of the royal family of Hyrule is inscribed here. Alright. What's out of here? The outskirts. This place gets more lively at night. Too bad I have to patrol. Maybe I'll take some time off to check that out. Uh-oh. What are we talking about with liveliness? Ah, uh, hello. I saw a pot in there. I've heard that the forest is filled with more monsters. I, I guess that's where we're going, is the forest. Yep, seems that way. Yo, Raz, how's it going? Redeads everywhere? Potentially, yeah. Contorted Gorge. I guess we're going up the mountain, huh? It's like a key change on uh, Hyrule Field. Uh-oh. I heard that on the mountain peaks there is a mansion. It is strange, a strange place that holds many secrets. Wish I could just once make medicine with some of the strange things I might find there. May not be able to see very well anymore, but my nose still works fine. Okay, so I probably have to bring uh, like a mushroom back to her or something. Ooh. Okay, hold on. Oh, I bet I could angle this. Hold on. Ah! Come on! It probably wants me to climb up this ladder. How you doing today, Ras? Hopefully you're doing well. Alright. Somehow I feel like I'm not gonna make this, but we'll try it. Oh, never mind. Whoa! You can actually see outside. Nice. <clears throat> so many doors and ladders, right? Okay, so it's actually, uh, the time of day is moving here. Uh, hello. Oh, that's pretty neat. You could do a little platforming trick to get some, uh, some red, uh, a red rupee here. Was this like a boulder farm or something? Castle Town. Well, it is almost nighttime. I could probably go back into Castle Town and uh, and see what it's like there. Yeah, so far this has been pretty interesting. Oh, have you played this ROM hack already, Russ? The outskirts. Oh, there's music playing now. Oh, hey, buddy. We sell shields, but not swords. I'll, I'll take a Deku shield. I'll definitely take that. Finally, I don't feel naked anymore. Much better. Is that all there is out here, though? <clears throat> oh, you've already beaten it? Nice. All 
All right. Dampy out here? He is. Don't mess around with the graves. All right, apparently I can't skip through this. What's gonna come out? Watch it be a redone. Thanks a lot. You're welcome. You know what, just for you, I'm gonna pull open a grave. Yeah, here. No! Uh-oh. Found a hole. I imagine you could only open the graves at night. Oh. Is this blue fire? It appears to be some kind of monolith. Don't want to spoil any, anything, so I'll be watching only. I appreciate it. Think I can hear something resonating within the stone. <clears throat> Keep the moon song in your heart. Interesting. So is this like... The reverse sun song? <laughs> That's pretty neat. Reverse sun song. I like that. Now, is this actually blue fire? No. No blue fire. I like that. <laughs> is that all that's in here? I guess so. I like the design of this. Oh, nothing here. Nothing at all. Nothing at all. Let's see if there's any other graves I can open up. Guess we open them all and just find out, huh? <laughs> I'm gonna fuck this graveyard up. Oh, yep, yeah, there we go. Another hidden one. I could totally see a Gibdo coming out of this. Or just a heart. What's in here? Nothing from the looks of it. Oh! Okay. So yeah, I have a fire source. Like either dense fire or fire arrows or something like that. <clears throat> oh no, I've been jounced. Alright, it's a good idea to keep that in mind. Alright, what about these? Man, look at all these bloopings. <laughs> Alright, what about these? Should be all the grains. Oh, I hear a skull too. Wait, hold on. 
Why did I get a a secret sound? Also, I might get that without boomerang. Hello? What secret opened up? Happy one hour? You mean happy two hours? Alright, red ruby. We could probably get the piece of heart now that we got in the red ruby. If this works the same way as uh, Dampy Grave Digging Tour works in uh, OOT. Oh, he's got to move a bit. Let's try it now. Okay. I suppose they're trying so hard to hit me. It's not even gonna work. <laughs> nice target. Oh, there's a green rupee. I think it's like four green rupees, two blue rupees, a red rupee, and then a heart piece. There's our heart piece. Alright. We just get uh, one more heart piece and we'll be at four. I wonder how we open that. Finally. Yeah, the luck was not with me at first. I wonder if this changes at all at night time. No, it doesn't. Still pretty funny though. <laughs> I wish that kid would stop imitating me. Alright. Uh, there is that night owl area. That we can go check out real quick. By the way, this castle town is huge. The Night Owl. This fine establishment usually doesn't let kids in, but you look like you got some cash, tell you what. Ten rubies to get into the Night Owl. Sure. I like how you're a bouncer. That key proceeds to the room ahead. Is that an owl statue up there? <laughs> I kind of like that design. Oh, we got we got our first gossip stone. <laughs> Interesting. I've heard about you, kid. Nice work breaking out of that castle. Don't worry. The guards wouldn't ever try coming into this place. I heard something else interesting, too. It seems those two really didn't want anyone going up north. <laughs> Fark. Something to do with three stones, but you wouldn't know anything about those, right? Might be worth looking at your map. Press start to enter the subscreens and Z or R to find the map. Yes, I got all that. <laughs> Imagine finding the owl in the night owl. Okay. So they say basically... This 
Hello? Why does this all sound like bombable walls? Now I am confused. Interesting. Why are you flying? Good question. Yo, purple rupee. There anything back here? No, I guess not. What the hell? <laughs> Yo, everyone just partying it up here. Oh, that's where that's where the owl flew. That Gordon over there told me that his big brother found a hot spring while mining up north. But when I got there, the whole place was flooded. I'm not going to tell you my life story, kid. Go bother somebody else. Yo, he's smacking his belly. What a way to live life. Alright. We got, uh, we got quite an interesting, uh, area here. Alright. <laughs> the core reminds me of the chunk. Kind of, yeah. Not wrong. Alright, this must be the storeroom or something. I don't see anything important here. At least yet. Alright. Should be able to, like, talk to that one. Oh, hello. Do you know about the Temple of Time out in that desert? Legends say that the Temple of Time is the entrance to the Sacred Realm. Did you know that? Yeah, lady, I actually came from there. Alright, what does this guy say? What a crazy guy. What a cast of characters we got here. Oh no! It's only a matter of time before the guards bust this joint. Really? Did I come up here just for that? I guess we can always just listen to this. <laughs> Imagine your laugh sounding like that. You know the Muffin Man? Legends say the Muffin Man is the entrance to the Sacred Realm. Yeah, the Muffin Man who lives on Drury Lane. Well, I'm glad we found the Cursed Laugh. Alright, what else is up here? What was the importance of finding this place? Oh, uh, can I totally drop this chandelier on them? No, I can't. That's unfortunate. Now I'm king of the world. I'm sure this plays some important slider on down the road. Oh boy, money. Alright, 
I think it's time we go to the forest. I think it's about that time. Oh, this is not the forest. This is definitely not the forest. This is the castle grounds. Hello? Okay. So this is where my Kikiri brothers and sisters are all held up at. A lot of, uh... A lot of butterflies here. Sadly, doesn't look like there's a grotto. Yes, that's not going to help at all. Buddy, I don't have anything to sell you. Okay, so time does pass here. Hey, what's back here? Oh my goodness. There's a lot of money in this game. I will say that much. Alright, what happens if I walk up to these guards? Do they throw me back in the gel? They do! <laughs> Wow! Talk about a hell of a warp back. I guess that's how you can get back in. Uh, let's see. I'm gonna have to remember these songs. They're just Shadow. What does the Moon Song actually do? I imagine it's like a Reverse Sun Song. We can try it real quick. Yeah, makes it night time. Let's see if it makes it daytime, or if it's just constantly nighttime. Oh, it's, it's basically Sun Song. Fair enough. Alright. The outskirts. I like how you can just straight up back walk all the way out here. To the contorted gorge. Oh, I bet that's a grotto just waiting to be opened. Oh, we gotta check this house out. What even is this place? I saw it in the title. Like, the title screen. Cool. I like me a general store. We moved here from the castle town. I know times are tough, but I hope you will be a steady customer for us. Okay. You know what? I could use some nuts. Oh boy. Oh yeah, pickaxe. Wait, is that the guy's shadow? 
Just being casted down here? Also, that poor cow. Money doors and ladders. Yeah, is basically what this rum hack is so far. Money, doors, and ladders. That looks like the entrance to the forest. Is there anything back here? Alright, so I need bombs to go that way. And that seems more likely to be the pathway up the mountain. It's like a minecart or something? Are there are mines down here? The flooded mines. Yep, yeah, sure enough. Alright, obviously we're not supposed to be here yet because they keep hinting towards the forest, so let's head that way. Alright, apparently the forest is full of monsters. Look at all this money! Yeah, so far the rum heck has been really nice. Try going. Ah, okay. So it's just like oh, it's see. You kind of tell which way, which path to go down. Or can you? Yeah, I guess you still kind of can. Deku sticks. You know what? I'll take that. I'll definitely take that. So that looks like there's a grotto there, but I need bombs. It looks like I can plant beans here too, so... Why not? I think we can plant something here. I bet someone in town might have something like that. Yeah. Beans. Yo, Shigatura, how's it going, man? Hopefully you're doing well. Slow minor Kakari Forest theme. Uh oh. Uh oh. You know what time it is. It's Timmy time. I'm doing pretty good. I uh, haven't streamed in a little over a week. I had a family member that was uh, that was in the hospital for a while. But he's finally back home recovering. I figured I'd ease back into streaming a bit. And this ROM hack came out like last week, so. I figured I'd start out with that. We saw butterflies trying to pollinate the rare boater flower. Yeah. <laughs> it sounds about right. That's where the other boater came from. They already completed pollination of it. Sorry, buddy. Interesting forest so far. I like it. There's so many bloopings. I've heard that the forest is filled with more monsters. It is. It absolutely is. You are absolutely correct, Navi. Oh, what's this? Pathways. Okay. 
How about we go back the way we came first and explore the rest of this? There's gotta be more of the Lost Woods, right? Alright, we're gonna be busy once we get Bomb Bag. Okay, that looks like a warp, warp spot. You know what? I need a stick. Give me stick. Huh, really? Okay, maybe we do go to pathways. Oh, that's an eerie looking sky. Alright. So far, we really haven't found, like, a, a bona fide dungeon yet, either. Oh, heart. I'll take you. Can we keep jumping over? We absolutely can. Where does this take me? Alright, we found a cave with a giant ass mushroom in it. Why does this remind me of the Minish Cap? Okay. Fishing ponds. Oh no. <laughs> There's fishing in this. <laughs> Mushroom pog, fishing pog. Is it really pog though? I guess we take a crack at it, huh? Biggest fish is six pounds, huh? See what we got here. I mean, yeah, the fit. This does look really nice. Also, uh, I can't help but notice that I can't see the fish. Okay. Interesting. All right. No fast casting. Oh, now I can see the fish. That's a very deep pond, by the way. <laughs> I could totally see the fish whenever I was playing. It, it may be the, um, the emulation I'm using. Two pounds. Oh boy, two pounds. Very nice.
Do I even want this? I kind of want to peek underneath the water. A pretty small fish, too. <clears throat> sure, we'll keep that one. Yeah, texture on this water is going to make it kind of difficult to, uh, to see what I'm aiming at. Ah, so I'm using, um, the parallel core. So I guess the texture is a little bit different on this one. I wonder if I got to a different spot. And took a quick peek. Give myself a better idea of where the big fish are at. Kind of hard to tell. That one over there kind of looks big. It is nice music, though. Wow, he jumped for it. It's the same fishing pond from Zelda. Vin oh, you're talking about, like, the, the locations for the big fish? In that case, this boy over here should be the big fish to go for. Alright, he looks a little bit bigger. He's definitely fighting more, so. He was only four pounds, though. That's the biggest fish I've found so far. boy looks big. Okay, hold on. Oh, did I catch the big boy? <laughs> I, w I wasn't even paying attention. I couldn't even see the fish grab it. Maybe the big one got scared, who knows? I mean, this definitely looks big. Okay. Whoa! Oh wait, I need to catch a bigger one, don't I? Oh wait, dude. Okay, so time slowly goes here, too. Ugh, pounds, America units. Yes. Alright, you know what? Uh, I say we come back to this later. Head off to bed. Yo, thanks, Waffles, for uh, stopping by. I appreciate it. Alright.
Yeah, I don't know if I'm supposed to be able to like see through that texture either. Hmm. Okay. So I guess I need bombs to get that heart piece. That's what it looks like, at least. I have a question for you. If one were to, say, be looking to run some rando again, what's new that I should be aware of? Oh, as far as uh, OT rando? Do you have a solid preset I can use? Um, if you're looking for something on the standard set, uh, Season 4 of League Settings just came out not too long ago. Um, it's kind of different from some of the some of the standard settings that we were familiar with uh, from a while back. Because this has beatable only instead of all locations. Um, but it's it, it's been a pretty fun seat setting that I've played so far. I would recommend that. Um, you can find it on the, on the, um, the standard dev build. It should be a preset, uh, like League S4. Yeah, be beatable only so far has been really nice. Uh, it also has, I want to say, five medallion Ganon's Bridge, six medallions Ganon's Key. Um, it also has, um, a new hint feature that does double hints. So, say, for example, you get a hint for Colossus. It'll give you the checks for both the Colossus hands. Uh, same for, uh, the Royal Family Tomb. It'll give you a hint for the, for both the song and lighting up the torches. Yeah, that, that's been a really fun one. Uh, I think they did, like, the second season of Trifor Triforce Blitz a while back. Uh, and then if you're looking for, like, some spicy stuff, um, some of the other dev branches have some pretty new settings out. Um, for example, I want to say Rob's dev branch has uh, shuffled wonder items, which are basically, like, the invisible items that you would jump into to get, like, the red rubies and the... Um, uh, over the drawbridge. Uh, it also has like anim or enemy uh, enemy drop shuffle, and then you have Fennel's dev branch, which can do um, uh, like different entrance rando options. Like you can uh, you can mix up uh, entrance pools with boss entrances too. So you could have like boss dungeon mix uh, mix pools. Uh, with that one, you can also have uh, dungeon rewards shuffled anywhere so you could have like a completely uh mixed up randomizer where you're, you just find all of your dungeon intro uh your dungeon rewards in the overworld all right so it looks like i need to go this way i'm guessing this would be like the deep woods or something Shuffle everything in, no logic. Oh, wait, I'm back in the outskirts. Okay. Interesting. Is there just, like, a fast way up here or something? I guess... Oh, maybe not. Maybe this is a shortcut back to the outskirts. I think I need to go up that way. Or just across the bridge, honestly. Wait, what's down here? Oh, I bet you could totally clip out of here. I bet if you tried hard enough, you could clip, clip through that. Oh yeah, for sure. The only thing I would say about the Fennel Dev Branch is, um, I've been I've been making some scenes out of it uh, for a while now, and it is the Dev Branch that's like the most prone to crashing. So uh, 
You definitely want to be careful with that dev branch, but most of the other ones uh, tend to be pretty stable. Alright. Is this something I can find? No. A site was so fun. Are you talking about the outskirts? Alright, maybe I'm supposed to go into the cave. Also, the music be kind of weird. It's like it's almost a little bit off-putting. Oh! Now I think I realize what I have to do. I have to do fishing. Because I bet more than anything the reward is the skill. Oh, that is unfortunate. Is there a way back up here? I bet not. I bet I have to run all the way back around. That is unfortunate if that's the case. Then I have to do fishing for the skell. Wait, can I just straight up get back up here? You can! Okay. Interesting. Yo! Charlie, how's it going? Oh, last night in real life. Went to Eurovision preview party and met two Eurovision stars from last year. Nice! Alright. This looks harder. Uh, I mean, difficulty-wise, it hasn't been too bad. Uh, it did throw a nasty curveball at me earlier in the in, in the Skultula house. It put a uh, it put a dead hand, or just the hand from a dead hand, uh, around a blind corner, and it caught me off guard while a uh, floor master just beat my ass. So I wasn't I wasn't prepared for that. But otherwise, it hasn't been bad at all, honestly. Alright. In the Dongo life. Alright. Nice. Nice. So because I missed that jump, I bet I'm gonna have to go all the way around again. Oh, never mind. You know what? I'm thinking too small or too big, brain. I was always able to come back here. Get out of here. Yes. So, it's, uh, the skull hints are part of, like, the new set of miscellaneous hints now. So, I think, like, right before you stopped playing Rando as much, there was a, uh, miscellaneous hint that came out for Dampy. Um, which I don't think is used for League, but, uh, you could turn on, like, the miscellaneous hint for Dampy's diary as an adult, and it will hint you towards one of your, uh, hookshot locations. Uh, you got, you got miscellaneous hints now for all the Skulltula rewards, but I think Ling only does 30, 40, and 50. Alright. So, if they're all in the same positions... The big, the big boys should be, like, right here. Yeah, he looks pretty big. Yeah, blue fire ants. So, yeah, just just like the name says, they uh, they share the same properties as blue fire. Um, let's see what else is came out. There, there's honestly been a lot of new settings. Um, key rings. 
So key rings is a thing now in, in the, uh, the stable version. So you can basically take all of your dungeon kings and group them together into one item. Um, there's also a regional uh, shuffle. So what it would do is like say you want like a lighter version of shuffle anywhere or overworld shuffle. Uh, you could take something like the fire temple key or the fire temple kings. If you shuffle them to regional, they only shuffle in the Death Mountain area. So like the Dongo's Cavern, Death Mountain Trail, Death Mountain Crater, Goron City, Fire Temple. Um, and it basically just matches the region color um, for that particular dungeon. So red is Fire Temple, green is Forest Temple, uh, orange is Spirit Temple, so on and so forth. Oh, it's not a skell. I was hoping it would be a skell, but I get that as an adult. That's unfortunate. Okay, so fishing is not the key. Fat fish pog. Oh, you did play with the key rings on dev? Uh, I think on some of the other dev branches. Like, for example, the stable dev branch. Now it has a bomb chew bag, which I, I, I haven't tried that one yet, but I assume it plays like um, bomb chews in logic. See, League went to Fitz Adult Spawn. Yeah, Fitz Adult Spawn and starting with Fair Wars, I really like that feature. It's not like Fair Wars opens up any uh, any specific checks for you, it just it's just nice quality of movement. Alright. Wait, what the hell is that back there? Hello? Why does that look like it's on fire? Okay. Alright, I guess I'm not getting up there because I don't have a hook shot. What's on this stump? Can I even get on this stump? I can. Clearly, there's something in this area that I'm missing. Alright. Well, let's try looking elsewhere in the woods. It's like a dungeon of sorts is up there. <clears throat> you can do it! Bite this freaking head off! Maybe there's more in the Lost Woods that I haven't noticed yet. Oh, hey, it's Tihu again. What's up? Oh, uh, yeah. I will be right back, chat.
All right, chat. I have returns. Oh. I forgot I left my timer right on one. <clears throat> oh, yes, the spinning chair emote. All right, let's see if we can um, find out where else to go here. We got this area. But I'm gonna need a bomb for it. We got this area. Which, honestly... Okay. So I guess I didn't need the scale for that. Purple. Wait, was that all that was back here, though? <laughs> I thought this was gonna be like story progress. Instead, it just ended up being a purple ruby. Well, that's unfortunate. Yeah, it's it's weird. Like I can see through this water, but I can't see through the water in a cave. And now I got the feeling that there's probably something in the cave that I need. So maybe I should go back there and check it out. That's not it. This is it. Unless well, there's like a secret entrance or something up here, but I don't see it. I don't see there being one. Got lost so many times in this ROM hack. I mean, it's just kind of like par for the course, honestly, with some of these ROM hacks. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna try checking the cave a little bit more. See if that's the way to go. Oh, hold on. Hold on. I didn't even notice that little, uh... Cliffside there. Well, I guess I found my way. Forest Grotto. Is it really a grotto, though? I guess technically it would be. I guess this would be more like, more like a cave. Oh. I see we got some Master Quest torch placement. I've been playing OT for 25 years and this ROM hack for two. Yeah. Yeah, it's a good way to put it. See anything else back here? <clears throat> now, this feels more like a bona fide dungeon. Or at least a miniature dungeon. I like the uh, I like the nice ambience with the music. All right, is there a way to get up here? Does not look like it. Oh, it looks like we have more uh, more water that we can't see through. Should be two more silver rubies. 
The one back here? No. Ah, uh, there's one. Don't tell me the last one is down here in the water. Okay, apparently this water is not very deep. Uh-oh. Alright, let's see here. Just gonna follow the water line so I don't end up uh, going into deep water and losing the stick. <clears throat> Ooh, big chest. Alright. What are we gonna find here? The dungeon map. Cool. Okay, this isn't like a big dungeon. It's got a lot of interesting side doors, but nothing too big. Kinda wanna find that last silver ruby though. Otherwise I'm just gonna have to pick the rest of them up again. Do not see it though. It wasn't back there. Oh man. <laughs> if this silver ruby is actually in the water, I am less screwed. The music reminds you of Mist. It is in the water! <laughs> Good thing for Z target diving. <laughs> That's unfortunate. That is very unfortunate. No, not the nut. Deku nuts? Nah, I don't know. What about you? Eh, I'll take a Deku stick. Sure, why not? Is this a kill all monster room? Yep. Kill all monsters. I like the design of this uh, mini dungeon so far. It's not bad. Not bad at all. Alright, so we're up here. What does that give us? Aha! That's what it gives us. We drop down. We reach this area. Does L work to pop the map up? Uh, sadly not. Not from the looks of things. Cause I've, I've tried that and doesn't seem to work at all. Um. Uh... I think I know what it wants me to do. Yep, sounds about right.
Uh, touching the, using the D-pad so, uh, doesn't seem to work either. Let's see here. Let's get rid of all the enemies in this room too. Alright. Hmm. Okay. Got an idea. Probably not the intended strat. Yeah. Uh, so, uh, Rhett's, Rhett stopped by earlier to let me know uh, about the D-pad. So if you press down on the D-pad, even if you don't have the ocarina on the C buttons, you can still use it. Chet, that's neat. Oh, I think I know what to do. So I guess I could reach that then. Oh, of course. <laughs> because I pulled <laughs> I pulled the sword out, I lost my flame storage. Nice. I appreciate it. Alright. <clears throat> yeah, I think Rhett's let me know about that. Um, not long after I started this. Alright, let's get this skull, though. There's no telling what we're gonna find on those skull rewards. I don't know if I'm going to 100% this yet, but might as well grab him while I can see him. Oh, happy three hours, by the way. <clears throat> ah, okay. So I need to come back here with a slingshot. But that door opens? Huh. Okay. Not quite sure what caused that door to open. Maybe it was me burning the web? I am a moron. <laughs> Alright, let's try that again. I'm guessing this is a slingshot. Killing the enemies open the door? Possibly, yeah. Slingshot! Well, that fairy disappeared. Doesn't look like there's anything else in here. I appreciate that they do not respond to enemies in this. That's nice. Alright, so now I could get myself caught again and hit that um that eye switch in Hyrule Castle. Nice. Fantastic aim. Alright, easy enough. Okay, so apparently that's not working. You know what? I'm just gonna let him drop. Or that works too. <laughs> I 
that poor egg. Alright, nothing there. But we just keep climbing this. Ooh, damn, we're pretty high now. Uh, what all rooms have I been into? Not the two side rooms. So I guess I probably missed out on the compass. Ooh. Interesting platforming. Oh, that's a... <laughs> that's a, uh... That's a nifty feature. A pretty evil way to stick you into a room. Oh, shit. What are these? What are those? Get my po. Alright. Can almost guarantee you there's probably some sort of switch underneath one of these graves. Oh, what? Sure enough. Okay. What else? Oh boy, a red rupee. Oh, that would have been cruel. Dropping down here without... <laughs> without finding that switch. Okay. I guess while I'm back here, I might as well... Check this room. Since I'm on the ground level. Well, kind of ground level. It's kind of weird not having the dungeon map available. But this dungeon's small enough to where I think we can get by without it. Okay. Alright, how deep is this? Quite deep. So... I guess the intended way is to just light this and run around. And then jump across. Ah, yes. <laughs> I just had to take a shot in the dark and dive there. Oh, okay. Current's pushing me back. Oh, hello. Okay, I, I only knew that because of the... Of the, uh, the way that the ladder was sitting there. Okay. So it did spawn a chest. Is there anything else on it? Okay. Maybe not. So I'm guessing this is the compass. <clears throat> yep, it's the compass. So, right now, because... 
the L button doesn't function like it's supposed to. The map, the dungeon map and the compass are practically useless. You, well, at least it gives you an outline of the dungeon, but you just kind of find that out eventually anyways. Oh shit, hold on. Okay, so if I jump up over there... Is there a way to get over there? No. Which room did I go into to get there? I think it was this room, wasn't it? Because I want to get that skull. Does that show me getting all the skulls? No? Well, there's probably like another skull to get. Okay, so there's a ladder up there. And that looks like a void. We already at the boss. Ooh, hold on. This looks like a slightly different room. It's Goma, but the arena looks a little different. I like that. Now the question is, is Goma different? Oh, of course, the nut button did not work. Yo, J Talica, how's it going? Ooh, I like the music, though. Alright, so Goma looks to have the same amount of health. Welcome back, he who was ill. <laughs> Thank you. Poor Goma. I even let Goma live a little bit long. Hold on. This is where I came from, right? Why does that look like a bombable wall? Is it just like the same texture that was used in the Goma room for vanilla Deku Tree and it just looks so out of place in this arena? I guess so. <laughs> yeah, I guess I am a little bit of a murderer, huh? Uh oh. We have defeated the evil first force lurking in the forest. Uh oh, severe weather alert? Oh, great. Well, under a tornado watch. Though we have barely started this journey, the curse placed on this land has likely spread far beyond this place. The spiritual stones provide a source of power for these monsters. And yeah, we must, we must find the other stones. This is Hyrule's final hope. Ascend the mountain. There, you will surely find the other stones. Let's take this stone with us. We must guard it at any cost. Okay.
Got the Kikiri Emerald. I can feel a great power emanating from the stone. Let's look for those other stones. Alright, I got you. It keeps panning over to that fire. As if there's something drastic happening over there. I got involved in an interesting debate on Team Dark Side's Discord. Uh-oh. Is it one of those which weapon is meta debates? Oh, why is Banbro in every map in Iceborne? Okay, so it's a bit more benign. still can't believe there's such a shortcut here that I never even looked at. <laughs> That's interesting. Oh, there's a red rupee up there. Alright, so we're supposed to head up the mountain. Contorted Gorge. So, I guess, in order to get up to the mines, well, in order to get up the mountain, probably have to go through the mines? I bet. I've heard that Gorons leave their belongings in the mines. Yeah, that sounds about right. Oh, this is cool. <laughs> I like how there's a little conveyor belt there. It's a good question. Why is Bamboo in every map in Iceborne? He's treated uh, just like uh, any other monster or any other invasive monster like Rajang and Devil Joe. You can shoot through that? I didn't know that. I get the feeling I'm supposed to be able to see through this water, too. J just a theory. Nice. <laughs> Someone mentioned he is an herbivore, but apparently has a weak stomach, so he often goes to hot springs after eating. Huh. Interesting. Oh, man. Why do I get the feeling that there's going to be water all over the place in these dungeons, and I'm just going to have to dive to find out if there's anything important down here? Floating seats. Okay, so there's definitely something down there. That I'm going to need probably a goat scale for. You had an epiphany. What was the epiphany? Okay. Maybe that's hookshotable? Wait, hold on. I hear fire. Nice. <laughs> I like how I got a uh, ISG off of that. Wow, what a surprise. Underwater ladders. I like this. <laughs> you are here. At least it does a halfway decent job of, uh... Like, giving you a map. Only have a few minutes, but I hope you have a good stream. Yo, thanks for uh, thanks for the good luck, Toad fan. I appreciate it. Hopefully your night's going well. The facts that led my theory. Banbro is capable of rolling balls of things. Has a weak digestive system, and every map has a monster. Banbro is a poop eater. 
I mean, could be on to something there. Alright, hold on a second. Okay, so that didn't work. It definitely didn't work. <laughs> I thought I could light the bomb flower and they just blow up, but uh, now they behave like normal in this. Okay. What's this open up though? Okay. Except for finding out my Space Channel 5 disc won't load the second level. That sucks. I'm sorry to hear that. Okay, so it is tied to that platform. Hmm. Interesting, uh, use of the conveyor lines for the platform. Alright, so now that we have that. Ooh. So you have to use both boxes. Okay. Uh, of course. Wait. <laughs> what did I do? Okay. Hold on. Hopefully that doesn't unload the bots in this room. Did it? It did. That's unfortunate. That's quite unfortunate. What's up here that I need them? Hmm. Uh-oh. The suck. This is... This is why the Gorons always forget their stuff. They're getting all sucked up. <laughs> Floor skin pop? Wait. Did that, uh... Did that show up on your screen? A scale, okay. So apparently the door, the uh, the Dorans, the Gorons can dive. Is that the only thing in this room? I guess so. It showed up in my heart. <laughs> I may have to update my um my OBS to show uh, seven TV notes. Because I believe that is one of them. See, now I'm curious what this... What all this switch does. Oh! Does it do both of these? It does. Okay. Have to add it to your channel. Oh, that's probably what it is. I probably haven't added it to my channel yet. That's, that's a good call. Alright, so... Nice. This is gonna be annoying. Oh my goodness. <laughs> this is it, chat. This is where I drown. This is definitely where I drown. Because I have no idea where I'm going. Okay, I got lucky. Man. 
Man, imagine. Uh, uh. Alright, so it looks like most likely we're gonna find strength here. The Gorn bracelet. From the looks of things. Hey! No more floating seeds. Uh oh. It's Dudongs. That's not close enough, is it? Definitely not. Oh, hey! It's a Dinophos. Okay. Okay, thank goodness. I don't have to walk back too far. Oh, hey. Yeah, Donafos with the Kikiri sword. That's no bueno. Alright. Why well, do I get the feeling I'm gonna have to blow up every single one of these? That would be slightly annoying. Um, let's see, what is over here? Just the bomb flower? Oh, excuse me. Okay. <laughs> so I had to kill every enemy from the looks of it. Uh oh. Is this strength? Or is it a bomb bag? I have the Gorn's bracelet! Yay! Alright, now we can start using these. There's a possibility that we find. A bomb bag in here, too. I guess we just gotta blow up all these just to be thorough. Oh boy! A red rupee. My favorite. It's a sling slong. I like the atmosphere of this, though. It's like, it takes the ambiance of uh, Dodongo's Cavern music and adds a bit more echo to it. Alright. So that's gonna be a problem. Nope, it's actually not gonna be a problem. Now that I think about it. Ah! I didn't get it. Sling shit. Ah. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Wait a second. I was about to say, this doesn't like them. But obviously that platform is there to let the bombs drop without them blowing up or without the fuse going away yeah it seems to be the case okay so then I may have an idea on that I think I need a Bringo. Where's that skull at? I hear a skull. 
It sounds like it's up there. Okay, I think I have an idea. Because this is all the same room. Yeah. Interesting uh, method to line up the uh, the very first room that you find in here and make it so that you have to uh, carry a block from one end to the next. That's exactly what it is. That is exactly what it is. Okay. Huh. If only the water was clear and I could just see that from the very beginning. But otherwise, that that's pretty neat. I like that. Alright. That question is, where the hell do I go? Have I been in here already? Oh no, it doesn't look like it. Uh oh. Alright. Gotta watch for rolling boaters. Let's see what else is here. Oh boy. Why do I get the feeling that there is a, uh, there's something underneath the water? That's unfortunate. That's quite unfortunate, but there is a skull back here. I wonder if this would be more stable on Mupin. I'm not entirely sure. I may have to give it a shot. But the problem is, it's like, whenever I play vanilla OOT on the Mupin core, it randomly crashes on me. That was not close enough. Okay, I guess it didn't matter. <laughs> I bet you could totally jump past this, too. You totally can. <laughs> what the hell? Ow. Oh, that's what it's meant for. Ow. Okay. I see what the deal is now. Nice. Didn't get a crash when using the Mupin Core? Yeah, I may have to go to it then. I'm glad that that worked. Alright. We got another gossip stone. <clears throat> Ooh. 
Okay. The Mountain Trill. 333. Happy 333. A lot of interesting overworld uh, locations, that's for sure. All right, so what's here? Oh, okay. <laughs> I guess that's one way to, to get back here pretty fast and just completely avoid the mons from now on. Who needs a bomb bag whenever you just got random bomb flowers all over the place? It's weird, I can see that. Uh, I can see underneath the water there just fine. Uh oh. This is where I just came from, right? The mobs? Oh, okay. <laughs> Big fat X. All right. Got a flag over here. Um, I think it's a little bit too far for Link to make. I think. I'm kind of curious about what's down here. You never know. Bonking one of these boxes might lead to a heart, uh, heart piece. Doesn't seem like there's anything here. <laughs> Would be better if it was just a big no. You read it and then Rets, uh, lets uh, Luthor just streams out wrong. Good old respawn and glaze. Had to make sure it wasn't like a. Okay. Yeah, I like how <laughs> this is literally just Hyrule filled, but key changed. Get out of here. Okay, that's what I need the. Uh... The strange floor. It's more than a key change, but yeah, the melody's the same. Alright. So it looks like... Nice. Whoa! Those rocks went all over the place. Is this the Nets dungeon? Uh, yeah. Yeah, it's the Nets dungeon. <laughs> Semantics. Sounds like they've taken each track from the original and tweaked just the notes. Either the notes or the ambiance. Same rhythms, different scale. I was half it. <laughs> I was half expecting it to uh, to be a bloopy, or uh, not bloopy, but uh. Uh, what should I call it? Purple Rupee from MM. Mm. 
This is an interesting design for the Dongo's Cavern, not gonna lie. I don't think the, the Dongo's Cavern is a very dungeon-y sounding place. I like how it's full of sand now too and not lava. It's not quicksand either. Let's see if killing all the enemies in the room spawns anything. Doesn't look like it. Not gonna lie, that's kind of cheap. Not gonna lie. Let, let's just go ahead and blow you up. So the mouse already opened, too. Interesting. So there's like, there's no second floor to this place. Okay. So my guess is that we're gonna find a bomb bag in here. All it takes is a nut. Yeah, there's a big chest there. Although that could be um, a compass. Could be a compass or a dungeon map, to be honest. Okay. Didn't think the platform was gonna curve like that, but... I guess I should start looking before I jump. There we go. <clears throat> All right, dungeon map. Let's see what uh, what we got here. Okay, so there is a second floor. Not too big of a dungeon, though. Not big. Let's see here. I guess we jump over to make it over to that room. But I kind of want to see what's over here first. So far, these, uh, these dungeons have been pretty interesting layouts. Kind of makes me curious as to what the um, the adult dungeon layouts are going to be like. Okay, I made that jump. Nice. Oh, so did I have to go around to get this? It looks like it, yeah. Okay. So yeah, that jumps just a little bit too far. Oh, but now I have two choices. Um. Hmm. Okay, this does lead to a dead end, so I think it's better that I go this way first. Alright, about to use some Armos mechanics here. Nice. Shit. You know what? You deserve a nut. Bubble. 
Bubbles? Bubbles. Okay. Uh, let's get the... This boy out of the way. Get the feeling that there's going to be something that unlocks once I, uh... Once I kill all the enemies in here. So, I, that's what I'm getting the feeling of. Yeah. It's just a way back. Okay. Oh, it's time to hydrate. Thank you, Raz. Jabu Jabu's Cavern, apparently. Kind of, yeah. How many skulls do I got now? Eleven. Okay. So, was this the only thing I needed in this room? It looks like it. Yeah, it looks like this is just back here for the skull. Interesting choice. I like the room design. Just kind of a shame that it was only here for the skull, as far as I can tell. Yo, Deka. Uh, so far, New Zelda goes pretty well. I'm, I'm enjoying this ROM hack so far. The, the dungeons feel familiar, yet the, the layouts are quite different. I like it. <clears throat> okay, now that we've been through there. Alright, this does take me back to center room. See if I can get you real quick. Looks like it wants me to jump over from the looks of it. But it probably wants me to jump over with a bomb. That would be my guess. So, yeah, this definitely screams you're getting the bomb bag in this dungeon. Alright, so in that case, let's go through here. So far, no fire keys. Goodbye. Sounds like there's one up there on the bridge. Oh! Okay. Evil Levers. Alright, I might have to come back here with a bomb bag. From the looks of it. Is there a way up here? No, I guess I dropped down. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, it's more like a, a cave filled with sand instead of a cave filled with lava. It's pretty neat. <laughs> Ground jump, that would be cheating. I mean, I'm not against doing that. Except this is kind of weird ground for a ground jump. There we go. <laughs> I 
DC and Vanilla wasn't really a fire-based dungeon either. Like, the very first room had lava in it. Dried up lava. Oh. So, I, I think I know what that door's there for. If you fall down into the pit, that's like one of your ways back out from the looks of it. Okay. How are we doing? We are in Dodongo's Cavern. The lava wasn't involved in any puzzles. I mean, the sand isn't involved in any of the puzzles here. To my knowledge, at least. Oh, hello. A Deku Shield. So that kind of tells me there are eventually going to be some, uh... Some fire keys in here? At least that's what I think. Alright. You gotta be careful this time. Oh, you're a little dick. You know that? That's such a weird... Yeah, I figured that's what was going to happen. So, the better thing might be to just hit them with the slingshot. And jump under while they're swinging. Because the timing for their drop is kind of weird. Normally they drop a lot, a lot sooner. It would also help if, uh, the platform wasn't jacket. <laughs> yeah, Skulltula is here kind of iffy. I think the problem is, is that they're so high up that it's hard to, um, Uh, how, how would I say it? It's hard to get to, uh... It's hard to get them to drop for you at all. Nice. I need hearts, but thank you for that instead. Ooh, if I could load that keys here. But the key seems to be stuck in the wall. Actually, I'm gonna reload that room. See if I can um, get some get a heart out of this grass. There we go. That's better. All right. Looks like I'm going this way. We got a bottomless pit. Nice. Oh, no, you don't. One heart. Oh, no. <laughs> Not that. <laughs> Anything but that. Is there a chasm down here? There is a chasm down here. So this is something that's not as simple as just jump slashing over. Okay. I disagree with that. I disagree with all that. <laughs> okay. Really? Oh, okay, you know what? Not even gonna bother. Also, thank you for the lurk kill. Gonna play that multi-world to boys. Feel free to pop in after you want. Oh, are y'all starting that to? Oh, yeah, that's right. Y'all wanted the y'all wanted the YAML files about tonight. Gotcha. Hitbots just seem weird in this one. A little bit. Hold on, I got an idea. 
No! <laughs> it spawned out. It was so far away that it just called itself out. That's unfortunate. Yo, Deca, thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. I kind of want that. See, I'm being, like, super careful about trying not to burn my shield off, but honestly, I have... 17 knots. Alright. Let's give this another shot. And whenever I tried to hit the nut, it didn't work. I gotta I gotta figure out what's wrong with that C down button. Man. Rip shield. It's okay. I got a bomb bag from the Dodongo's stomach. Alright. We do have that one, uh, that one boy that can give us a Deku shield. And I need to burn some money anyway, so. Bank shot! Ooh, and, uh... A nice bomb drop. Bomb back. Groundbreaking. Literally. We're about to break the ground with it. Does your streamer have trouble nutting? Does he have seeds lasting more than four hours? Vitamax cannot help you. Consult your physician. To nut. Oh, that's right. This is not the same room we just came from. Alright. Hold on. Interesting. I like the red ruby. I, I'm i not the biggest fan of those platforms or this room. On paper, the idea is nice. But... Those jumps do be a little janky. Got bomb bag without cheating, bike. <laughs> I'm guessing you could probably jump across that gap to get to the bomb bag. Oh yeah, hold on. Oh yeah, yeah. That's right. So now I do have to go up. But it looks like there's like a little room off to the side for some reason that I never got to. You little... I bet if you got lucky enough, uh, you could have a, uh, a Beemos blow up one of those boulders. Alright, we got our shield back. We good. Alright. Yeah, so far not a bad Dodongo's Cavern. This has been pretty interesting. Alright, I think we went up this way. Hold on. Where is that in- No, that's the way back out. H Hello? Okay. It's over here then. Uh, hello? How do I get there? Do I drop? I must drop down from upstairs. Which means that's like the fast way back up or something? 
I don't know, we're about to check. Whatever it is, it's in this room. Yeah, I guess that jump is a little bit too far, huh? <clears throat> the Dongo, your streamer, have trouble nutting. The Donko, he have seeds lasting more than four Dodongo. For that, Vitamats cannot help you. Consult your Dodongo, said Dodongo. Thick nut. Thank you, Buttspot. I appreciate that. You know what? I bet that's what it is. I bet if you fall down here, you drop down. And then you have to hit that switch to open... You know what? I kind of have to take the bait at this point. Otherwise, I'm not going to be able to get to that door. Oh, happy four hours, by the way. Alright. Interesting trap room. Interesting how the Dongo's Cavern is introducing Dinofolks this early. Which is an enemy you usually don't see until... Spirit Temple, I think? <laughs> Happy four hours, consult your Dodongo Shishin. Dodongo Shishin. Alright, is that all the... Can't really tell if that's all the... Hold on. I just realized I have not touched this doorway at all. But I'm pretty sure it's the, the method to get over here. Hey, how about you not burn my... Uh... Oh, okay. I was looking at the wrong floor. My bad. I am not getting a Link cosplay. I'm sorry to disappoint you. That That's for someone else to do. Alright. Let's, uh, let's climb back up here for real this time. Uh, we went out of the way to get that skull to the token. Yeah, whoever, uh, whoever developed this dungeon, they definitely know what they're doing with, uh, with how, how far spaced out you can have jumps. Alright, now... That, that wasn't what I meant to do. Nice. That was not a very great leap of faith. Ooh. 
this as a rando? Yeah, it would be pretty interesting. I would definitely have to practice this more. Get to the point to where maybe I do, like, glitchless speedruns of it. But yeah, it would be an interesting rando. Dark, Dr. Sofa King sex. <laughs> what the hell? What in the world is that emo? <laughs> I like that. <laughs> I like the, uh, the high, Hylian Stone Code Steve Austin. <laughs> Code Link Austin's got the same. <laughs> wow. Alright, that made my day. Yo, so fucking sexy. Thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. <laughs> Collect a tin piece of Triforce, turned it to the Triforce of Courage. courage. <laughs> Turn that son of a bitch sideways and shoved it up Ganon's ass. I like that. Best. Best chat all day long. Alright. How about this time, I look before I leap. That's better. Alright, now I can go through here. Now I'm gonna have to get the what sound command. Oh yeah, we are. Uh, we're not going through here. <laughs> we're we're not we're not letting the the boys hit us. Also, interesting how the Dino's Cavern has levers in it. All right. Is there anything else? I guess that just allows us to potentially go over there. Except we don't really need it. All right, what do we got in this room? There's our boss door. Nice. Should have known there was going to be a, a keys in here. Saw one. Of course, there'd have to be a second one. All right. So we're definitely not dropping down there. Let's see what's here. Damn. Interesting room. Nice. There we go. What? <laughs> okay, you know what? Interesting. Interesting place for a skull to Did you see the gameplay video in Tears of the Kingdom? Uh, not yet. I still need to, to look at it. But, uh, I mean, if you want to spoil it, go for it.
Okay. You know what? We're just gonna do it this way. Why was that that one so difficult? All right, this might be one of those weird-ish. But we're just gonna do that instead. Wait, huh, okay, cool. So you can actually see outside. I'll let you see it. Just some crazy shit about it, and I don't know how to feel. Ooh, okay. We're actually gonna kill this boy over here. Just in case there's a trigger for slaying all the enemies. That doesn't seem to be the case. Aha! So it was a... It was already a fire keys. That's unfortunate. Wait, there was a chest. Hold on. Hold on a damn minute. Where the hell's the chest? I had to be careful about jumping down there. Okay. <laughs> that worked. Uh. Alright. So apparently, there was a treasure chest. Somewhere in here. Is there like a switch or something I got hit? I feel like that's the case. Nice. Totally not what I wanted to do. I don't feel like I can make that jump back either. Nice. What? Would this have me do them? Cause I'm kind of curious about this now. No. Hold on. Why well, like there was something back here? Because there was. <laughs> okay, that was pretty interesting. And you know what? I'll just drop. Since I already spawned over on the other side. Yeah, I guess can we, we can go, uh... Go fight King Dodongo. That's not gonna hit. Yeah, that was a stinky chest. We honestly don't even need a... We don't even need a Deku shield here. Yeah, it was kind of a sneaky one. That That's kind of like, um... And Vanilla Dodongo's Cavern. 
the very first uh, room where you fight the Lizaphos at, there is a, uh, there's just a random heart, recovery heart, just hidden behind the lava fall. Wait, did this music not get changed? I guess not. Oh, I didn't get the bank shot. I have felt. <clears throat> yeah, that, um, that recovery heart, uh, is... Good knowledge to have if you end up playing on, um, like, freestanding Ruby Heart Sandy. Or freestanding Ruby Heart Shuffle, I should say. <laughs> Ray Dodongo demands the same music. Alright, that's two spiritual stones. It's me, Darunia. Well done. We've never met Darunia in this ROM hack. Thanks to you, my people can once again eat the delicious rocks from Dodongo's Cavern. What a wild adventure. It will make an incredible story. Well, this music got changed. Also, thank you for the 30 bits. I appreciate it. Uh, we just beat Dodongo's Cavern, so we got two spiritual stones. Did not know there was a heart in there. I have to see that myself. I can't believe that the Dodongo suddenly appeared in such great numbers. And that big rock blocking the cave. All this trouble must have been caused by those two witches. I always had a feeling that they were still serving Ganon. I won't be able to help this time. You, on the other hand, have the power to stop them. Kid, I like you. How's about you and I become sworn brothers? I, I still have no idea... If this is supposed to be, like, connected to the vanilla game, or is this just, like, an alternate timeline? <laughs> yeah, there's a- there's a big rock blocking it. How you rating this so far? I may be interested in playing this on my channel, too. From what I've seen so far, I- I would say... Like, a solid... Like, eight and a half out of ten, nine out of ten? As far as, like, overworld and dungeon designs. Like, there really hasn't been anything the exact same from the vanilla game. Although, it is familiar enough to where if you've played a vanilla game before, like, you'll be able to get yourself around and not have too much trouble. Yeah, this, this has been pretty fun. Ooh. Is there a nice little secret up here? Looks like it. Our first bombable grotto. What's in here? Okay, it may be a 9 out of 10. It may now be a 9 out of 10. I was expecting a generic grotto. I was not expecting this. Alright, you know what? Get out of here. Yeah, what a grotto. Tell me. This kind of reminds me of those random caves in uh, Twilight Princess. Hold on. I have to get you out of the way. Alright, I think I see what this is wanting me to do.
Excuse me? Zubats inclu included. Yeah, it, it seemed like it was climbable, but I wanted to see if I could make the jump first. Because I couldn't tell for sure if that platform was up against the wall or not. But I think that might be the case. Okay. <laughs> yeah, MM has like a similar void, uh, a similar void mechanic. The only the only thing that I have against the ROM hack so far is some of the jumps can be janky sometimes. Otherwise, it's not bad. Redead Scream, the rematch. Oh. It's not up against the wall. At all. That's why I didn't make it. So I do have to jump. Didn't... Alright, you know what? Interesting. I guess the first time I tried it, I just got unlucky with the void mechanic. I I almost fell off there. Drop and slash to back away. Oh, from the uh, climbable wall. If if the wall was a bit angled, I would be able to do it. But if I'm super close to the wall like that, I won't get the I won't get the recoil from the jump slash. I was about to say, there's gotta be more to this, right? Ooh, interesting. Okay. It was very close, yeah. Alright, so far, just a red ruby. Bye bye. Wait, that it? <laughs> that poor Donophos. Huh. So it doesn't look like there's any treasure in this cavern. It was a skull. Yeah. I will say this. Janky jumps aside. That's quite an elaborate grotto for a skull. All that for a token. I, honestly, I'm not miffed by it. Because if, if they des designed a grotto like that for a Skulltula token, I can't wait to see some of the other dungeons. To be perfectly honest with you. I bet you can hook shot up here. You absolutely can. Wonder what the prizes are, to be honest. So far from the looks of it, everything has been fairly vanilla. The Mountain Pass, okay. So this is probably the third spiritual stone, I would take it. The skull's getting harder, yeah. Oh, 
Oh my goodness. The overworld just keeps going and going and going. It's insane. <clears throat> and I would like to keep yelling. However, I think that's a good cutoff point for right now. This land and area dynamic is great. Yeah, so far I've been a big fan of the overall design. I've really liked it.